Oh, damn. Turret destroyed. That's no good. That's no good at all. What's up, YouTube? It's Fleshbox back in the house for another episode of Engineering Minecraft. And I was going to show you guys this uh, this person right here. Gear, There's... Gear and more gear. Yep. There's uh, actually one of these in every quest hub or mission hub, whatever you want to call it. Uh, what can I get for you? Basically, as you do missions, you get your vouchers that uh, are unique to each each hub. Appreciate it. I'll actually uh, show you here. Uh, as you can see here, I've got uh Andrew Station, Dredge, Shantytown, you know, all these vouchers and everything. As as you get uh as you get Have your missions completed here, you pick up these vouchers and you can use these to uh pick up nice items. The Copacabana vendor, it's it's all uh all weapons, but you can also get modules and, and abilities and everything at uh at these guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and spend twenty Actually, buy it. Helps. Okay. So there, there we go. There's our level five engineer gun. Got that all ready for when we hit level five. Figured we'd start out doing that. I'm gonna go ahead and go pick up another one. I'm, I'm not sure if I want to do every single quest or every single mission in the chain before I move on to the next area or not. Um, I think. I think what we're probably going to do is run uh, run missions up to level 5 here, and then maybe next episode we're going to do some thumping. Uh, let's see, aggressive medicine. Ares 3-5, this Pretty is sure Dr. Lisa done this Abrams, Accord Medical. Aranya attacks are taking a toll on the locals, and the situation looks like it's only getting worse. Do you need help treating them? That's the thing. Under Accord regs, I can't treat these civilians at all. But maybe you can help by destroying some Aranya pods before they hatch. Pay Ratchet a visit. You'll need something with quite a punch to destroy those pods. And she should have just the thing. Yep, I don't think we've done this one yet. Hey there, mate. I just got off the line with Accord Medical. They told me you were gonna blast through some Aranya pods. I assume you need something that explodes. Now that that would yours, certainly help. Here. Yeah, I was just making these modified mining charges. Once they're set up with detonators, they should do the trick. First, you'll need to rig the charges with detonators. It's a good thing the Accord have left a lot of junk around the area. You'll probably be able to find some functional detonators in their trash heaps. Any idea where a good place would be to start looking? I'll update your sin with a spot I've hit up in the past. The Accord might have an arc light full of equipment, but us civilians have to make do with what we can find. So, if you don't watch uh, any of the other videos I do, I've got myself some Celestial Wings. Or the streaming. I don't remember when I got it. Uh, oh, no. Wait. I think that was at the end of the last episode. Whatever. You found the trash heaps. Start digging. It shouldn't take you long to find what you need. Turn it up. It's gonna turn it up. Baby. It's time to tear it up. Yeah, tear it up. Tear it up. Think about it. I'm not actually sure what those little power-ups do. That little red thing I picked up. Watch out! We've got company. One more detonator, and we're done. Three five. Installed new hardware. Upgraded the turret. Oh, 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 I'm going up.
This is getting a little bit better. Turrets definitely make this a lot, uh... Make this a lot more interesting here. Wretched, we've got the detonators. It seems that one man's junk is another man's treasure. Welcome to my world. Let me patch a cord medical through. I hear you have what you need to start turning Aranya pods into craters? Yes, just point us in the right direction. The Aranyas tend to clump their pods together in communal nests. I've heard of one nest in particular where you should find plenty of pods. The waypoint is on your sin. Alright. There's a lot of travel in this game, so... If you've got the ability to obtain wings or an LGV or something, there's the nest boss. Place the charges on helps. the boss that mark. These aranyas are not happy with us. Oh, well, there's a lot of them. Oh my god. So, it seems like as an engineer your job is mainly to keep, uh keep things off of your turrets while your turrets kill everything. Upgraded. Aranya pods neutralized. Do you copy a point medical? Hey mate, the doctor's pretty busy. You still have any of those charges left? Yes, a few. Nice. And with working detonators. Bring your leftover charges back to me. I'll let Dr. Abrams know you took out those pods. Uh oh. So wait, Dr. Abram, Abrams just couldn't couldn't be bothered to uh, take my call? Could she possibly be doing that's so important? Like, she's just a doctor. Hello, Skeever. I'll take all the extra XP zoos that I want. So, let's see. Um, let's see, I, I did... Oh, come on, get up there. I did mention that I wouldn't be using any XP boosts. Um, it's mostly true. Um, of course, I've got the 25% boost from being VIP, which I can't do anything about. Um, but sometimes quests do reward XP boosts, so... And those are applied automatically, so we can't help it on those. But... It's like not anything else. Thanks, ordinary. mate. These charges will come in handy with the resource nodes I spotted earlier. Glad we could help you out. Hey, don't tell her I told you this, but Dr. Abrams has volunteered to pay you out of her own pocket. Now, if you'll pardon what me, a nice woman. I've got things that need tinkering. I oh look, look at that. Look There's at that. Some we are at level trouble five. Industry five. My responsibilities may prevent me from treating these people, but we do what we can. And it's good to have people like you around when we need a more aggressive approach. Potent heavy turret. That is an upgrade, so let's go ahead and do our swap around. Everybody doing the swap around. Uh, <laughs> um, so, okay, if uh, if you're not familiar with the game, I will explain. You know, these are both level 2 heavy turrets, but this one is a potent heavy turret, and you'll notice in the tooltip there, it'll show you what the potent means. Basically, it means the ability potency is increased. Um, not exactly sure what potency means. It's this turret upgrade potency. I'm assuming in this instance, like, when it upgrades, because it's an uh, upgrading turret, self-upgrading, again, if you read the uh, tooltip, it says, you know, self-upgrading sentry turret. So the longer it's up, the stronger it gets. I assume that potency means that when it does its upgrade, it upgrades more or something. Um, oh, look at that, a level 5. Um, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Let's drop in our level 5 here. Of course, we don't have any modules for it right now. Okay, both of those are a solid downgrade, so at this point we can go ahead and just uh, salvage this stuff. And I, I would recommend salvaging things that uh, 
you're unequipping immediately just to keep your inventory space free. Um, you'll notice you do get some bits and pieces, some Christite, and research points, man. Research points, that's the most important part right there. Cooled supply station. That'll be nice. I think uh, supply station is probably the next ability we get. So that'll be nice to uh, to have one already that's upgraded from the default. That's pretty sweet. Uh, I'd like to pick up some <laughs> lower level modules. Before I had so many low level. The heck? That was weird. What was I carrying? Um, but we are doing more damage already. Let's go ahead and spend our copper binden token. I think occasionally, I think you have a chance of getting a blue item here. One of these, I guess. Um, I think I've only had it happen once. All right, let's pick that up. Let's go get us another mission. Or do we want to go to the next uh, next area? I tell you what, we've got a few minutes left. I think we might have enough left for a thump. Let's go ahead and do a thump here. And the next episode, we'll go ahead and move on to the next area. How about that? Let's just pick somewhere random. I want to head quite a ways out, though. That was a thumper coming down. Uh, right here. Whoa, whoa, what the heck? Okay, that was weird. Uh, scan hammer. Okay, you'll notice it's got 28%. The way you read these is it creates this wave. Oh, look. You know what? Instead, let's go hit this chosen. That was rather easy. Oh. A run yet. Well, that wasn't as much as I was hoping for. <laughs> when those chosen pods come down, uh, they'll keep pumping out bad baddies until, uh, until you take care of them here. Go and thump this bad boy. Okay, you see this little waveform? It'll show you sort of Upgraded. what's in that area. With the higher peaks representing. Oh, oh my god! I don't know what's going on here. We got a seismic event or something. <laughs> we have more chosen incoming. I think that's what that red circle means. Yeah, okay, now we can see it. Well, this is awesome. You get to see, like, a whole bunch of the dynamic stuff happening right here. Good day, sir. That went quick. There's a lot of people playing right now. So stuff like that doesn't happen very long. Uh, 7%. Man, that's a terrible, terrible thumping area. 
All right, you'll see. Uh, yeah, only trace quantities detected. I think these areas up in here, the closer to the main area, the lower the quantities of pores. Let's head over here. Oh, there's another one. Hello. Come on, die. There we go. Let's go ahead and thump right here. Or not thump, but... Let's go ahead and uh, scan a hammer right here. Let's see how it looks. Only trace, huh? Well, we better find something soon before the end of this episode. Seven percent. Okay, you know what? I don't think we're gonna find anything really good thumpable here. Uh, that's a little bit better. So you come to the higher point in the wave. Higher points in the wave generally have a higher concentration. This is really flat. And that's basically how you read the, the scan report. Here's some right here. Thirteen percent. Now the point at which you take the reading is the only one that get, you get the nice so yeah, that 13 it would be literally if you dropped it right here. Yeah, let's try right here. 15, we're getting better. Seventeen. Nineteen. Now, I do think it's affected by the terrain. Twenty-one. So it's kind of hard to... Twenty-eight. I think maybe right here. Twenty-nine. So yeah, you can see how you can just kind of follow the waveform, looking for the highest point. Thirty-three. This over here looks good. Let's try it right here. 38. Oh, and there's a nice big spike over here. So right here. Look at that. 44. So yeah. Tell you what. Uh, let's go ahead and end this episode a little bit early here. And in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and thump this right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to hit that like button if you really, really enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Why not Zoidberg? And we will be back next time for more thumping. For more thumping, for some thumping, you'll get to see how an engineer thumps. Ooh, I'm going to go take that out. That looks like a lockdown. Um, so I'll be right back. Maybe I'll leave this in here. and We'll do this as part of the outro. Uh, but I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. You guys thought I was going to kill him, didn't you? I wouldn't do that. I'm not a murderer. I wouldn't just... walk up and kill somebody for no reason. Without... She died. Nice. Very well played, gentlemen. And Keith. Thanks. I appreciate the distinction there. Everybody always forgets.